Hey there, Julian here, and welcome to member script number 15. So this one is super simple, but also super important. So on the code front, all you're gonna need to do is grab that number 15 code, slap it in your body and call it a day. Uh, if you have a lot of pages that are using various member scripts, you're gonna wanna probably put it site-wide, but in this case, page is totally fine. So anyways, from there, you have that, and all you're going to need to do is add one attribute, like so, ms-code-refresh. Then you'll notice this is 500. The reason is because that is the amount of milliseconds with a delay. If you set this to zero, then it won't really have time to do anything or update anything. In this case, we're using other member scripts which are manipulating their JSON object, so we need to give it a little bit of time to actually do that. So we have it set to 500. If you're noticing that the refresh is happening before things have a chance to happen, you may want to increase that. If you think it takes too long, you could try decreasing it and so on. Now, this can be applied to anything. So we also have it over here when a project is created, for example, and you could do this with literally anything. All it is going to do is refresh the page after this amount of time. So add your code, add your attribute, and you are good to go. All right, have a good day. I'll talk to you soon. If you have any problems, just email julian at memberstack.com or let me know in the 2.0 Slack and I will talk to you soon. Bye.